thank you and welcome everyone. What a better company than, than having, of course, Margarita Delgado as the deputy governor. And then for the first time, having the CEOs of the top international banks based here in Spain, uh, Santander, Hector, welcome, and, and Amur, of course, from, from BBVA. The purpose of the conversation is to talk about our views looking forward. So the European Union, of course, is a very ambitious project that is based on solidarity and on cooperation, and that is strengthened by economic economic progress and social progress of our citizens. All our countries have to invest a lot in the, the green and the digital uh, transitions uh, and also in the strategic autonomy. First of all, growth is quite important. And we need to understand that uh, the only way that the European Union could basically make it on the long run is basically with growing. And, and the, the matter of fact uh, is that without the growth, uh, it's going to be very complicated in that sense. There was uh, one very important thing uh, that uh, Madame Lagarde basically said. She called the three Ds in which uh, we have particularly in Europe. She called it demographic, one of the most important ones, decarbonization and uh, the globalization, which Onu referred to. And I will add another fourth one, which uh, Margarita Delgado basically commented on, which is digitalization. And in that sense, I think it's quite important that we concentrate on, on what needs to happen in between that and the regulatory framework that we have need to lead us to that competitiveness. The role of the banks is even more crucial, crucial going forward. I mean, solid, healthy, good, profitable banks are needed for good economies. And there are so many studies on this which basically tells that if the economies, if they want to grow, banks have to be strong. I do think that the banks will play a very crucial role in the environment that you also described, which is we need more investments for green, we need more investments for digital in the countries that we are in. And in that context, the banks are here going forward to support this transition and to support the lending and to support the economic growth of the countries that we are in.